Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel and here we have Clash of Kings for Mountain Blade Warband so I've played the game a little bit without recording it for about half an hour I do have a couple of things to mention before we get into this battle over here so we have a new companion called Fena she looks like a warrior princess and I like my warrior princesses a lot I also have, well I did have a couple of Unsullied but I seem to have lost them so I've only got one left I did have three my money is going pretty well, I've got 3,004 coins with a weekly cost of 428 and I have 44 in my company. I think Gurnir Pike and Sir Clavis Liber both leveled up as well. This battle we have over here is between Sir Robert Brax who has 20 available in his party and Lord Sebaston Farman who has 59 out of available of 83. And they're against Lord Edmir Tully, who has 121. So they're up against it. We are still fighting for the Lannisters as a mercenary. And also, the reason why I have so much money is because I did loot the High Fall over here. And that gave me quite a few things which I could sell in some shops. So, without further ado, let's go straight to this battle and aid our ally. So, rush to the aid of Sir Robert Brax's party. We have 107 against 110. It's going to be a tight battle, this is. We're going to charge the enemy. And away we go. So, first things first. I think we'll get everyone to hold position on the hill about there. There they are in the distance. Here we go. This is going to be a big battle. Well, the biggest one we've had so far, anyway. And we have the first blood. I'm actually going to bring my troops forward to about there. Try and get a few shots off. Don't have very good archery skills. If I can get anything, that'll be good. Get some shots away, come on. Kill, kill that horse, take him down. Uh oh, we've drawn the attention of someone. Ah, sugar. Let's try and take him out. No, don't go for my archer. You slag. I'm here. No. Attack. Get him, Westerland Longbowman. Right, everyone. Charge. <laughs> Got pikeman there, I think. For the Lannisters! Die! Oh, we're not doing too well. We're outnumbered, we're not doing too well, I don't like this. That's right, get him. That's what I'm talking about, guys. That's right, charge him down, my horsemen are doing well. Cornering this soldier over here. I think the main battle may be lost, though. I've done some to horse damage. No, no. Get him, Gunia. Got the horse. Hoping Gunia can take him down. Go, oh, armoured he is. Let's go back to the main battle. I think we're going to lose this battle. It might be a good idea to retreat. Let's have a quick look. Dead 11, enemies dead 22. There are reinforcements, of course, so there's still a long way to go. Let's see if we can take out some of the archers. Need better weapons. Uh oh, again chased again by another horseman. <laughs> Let's try and drag them over here to my men. Oh. <laughs> it's going to be a long battle guys. I haven't done any dam much damage yet as well so I'm a bit disappointed. Need a, a pole arm really to to do what I need to do in this battle. Oh watch them, they got spears. Or bail uh, billmen they are. Right, reinforcements have arrived where are they? Other side of the battlefield. There's men up here blocking my way so I'm safer to stay down here. Charge! Clear my men. 
Well, they may have reinforcements. Delivered one damage. <laughs> I don't want to get off my horse because I'll be murdered fairly quickly. Doing whatever I can to survive. Yes, some more damage to him. Rally back round. Slash, slash, slash. If I get taken off my horse, I'm gonna. Oh my god, look how many reinforcements they have. Right, we've lost. They had lost 37. Allies have lost 24. We've lost 21. My enemies are edging it, I think. Oh my god. I'm getting chased by everyone. It's not looking good. Whoa, watch the spear, watch the spear. And we've gained a few kills, which is good. Slash time. Oh. Receiving lots of damage. Shields up. Ooh. Oh man. This is uh, quite difficult. Don't have the best of horses. I'm gonna try and go over there if I don't get shot to death. Of course, I think the horses in this mod they actually go a bit slower if they get attacked like this. I probably should have retreated, but oh, there we go. I was the last man. <laughs> At least I was the last man. So my my God, we are wounded. We've lost 20 morale. Oh, that was terrible. Still alive, that's the main thing. So let's get our asses out of here. Didn't get captured. We are faster as well than him. And look, Lord Gawain, Gawain Westling. This year we're going to accompany Sir Gawain. Oh, we're not. I was hoping that could accompany. Here we go. Accompany Sir Gawain. Nope, maybe not. Okay, didn't work. So. We can actually level up some of my men, which I'm going to do. So we'll have uh, Elite Westlands Men at Arms. we get a few of them. But we've lost most of our men, so we're going to need to recruit some more recruits. Let's go to Sean Hall, get some peasants. Um, let's head back to more marsh. If I can find some raiders to kill in the meantime, that'll be good. Oh, speaking of raiders, broken men. There we go. We are the free brothers. We fight only for ourselves from now on. Now give us your gold or taste our steel. I'll give you many good protection if you join my party. <laughs> Sounds like a good deal. Show us you're good. Pay us and we'll join you. <laughs> oh, your current action is disgraceful. You lose 11 renown. That's a shame. Damn it. But it's increased my, my party, which is what I wanted, so. I um, don't mind that at all. And we'll get some. Some peasants and we're looking pretty good. We got 42 out of a possible 52, so I'm quite happy with that. What happened to King's Landing? I could go to King's Landing. Ooh, broken men. Chase them, chase them, chase the broken men. Du -du 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 -du. Oh, we caught up with them. I could do the same with them, but I want another battle, so you'll regret leaving your army. 99 <laughs> against 17. I think my that Lannister, well, Westerlands, um, yeah, they've uh, reinforced us. That's what I mean to say. This should be a fairly straightforward battle. I need a spear, a good pole arm. Look, look at that horse over there with the pole arm. That's what I need when riding on horseback. All I have is my bow and arrow, my shield, and my sword. I don't actually have the best of health, so this kind of go against me a little bit. Let's dismount. No, can't get through. Oh, I'm trapped. Help me, I'm trapped. Stabby, stabby, stabby. Die, Lannister scum. Yes, we killed one. I do more damage on, on foot, so I might consider doing some more battles on foot. Die, you Lannister scum. Yes! Don't think I got the kill on that one. Nearly. One more. Right, 
He's mine, don't kill him, he's mine. Oh, I wanted him, you prick. I wanted to kill him. It is not good. Don't, I want to kill him. Leave him to me. Leave the Lannister scum to me. Fine. Out the way, horse. Get your ass out the way. Yes, I got him. Victory at last. Huzzah. Got a couple of kills, got some experience as well. I'm happy with that. So let's see. Yeah, two kills. My ally, Garrison Prester, had two kills as well. Get a prisoner. Thank you very much. Well, I hired him anyway. It's all good. We also have. Ooh, my. 76. However, if I. Company you. Then we could take him out. There we go, another battle. So we're going to have a third battle in this part by looks of things. Here we go. And we want to ally him with him again. We have 85 against 47. Yes, please. More blood and guts. More death. And now we're against Dragonstone. So I'm going to get my men just to charge in. No real tactical nous for this battle. Or maybe. Actually, yes, we could do. Let's put them up on this little hill by here. Try and get some sort of organisation. There we go, that looks beautiful. Looks absolutely beautiful. Loyal men of their liege. Uh, where are they? Where are the Dragonstone scum? There they are, they're over there. Didn't quite get a chance. And too far away, I think. Let's go to first person, I think. Let's, let's, let's fight this one in first person to, just to mix up a little bit. Just about to see where the arrows go in as well in first person. So it may help me out a little bit. Right, let's get my men to come by there. Yes, you hold on F1 to move your men to a certain location. For those of you that don't know. Oh yes, I prefer using it like this. I'm not really hitting anyone though. Oh my, right. Oh, I hit a friendly troop, that's not good. Think, think legless, think legless. Did some damage to a horse. Ah, you know what? Get the old sword and shield out. Do it the old fashioned way. Seek and destroy, seek and destroy. Die, you scum. Oh, he's one of mine. <laughs> you mine? Oh, you're not. Oh my god. Die. You well armored scum. Swing, swing, swing. Oh my. Nearly had me. Oh, I got him. I'm very proud. I've advanced the level as well to level 7. That's good. Tis good. And now I'm going to tell all my men just to charge. I think my ally has most of the kills in this battle. I wanted trying to conserve my men because I lost a few here in this episode. Ooh, a longbowman. I want to kill the longbowman, no. Yes, I got him. I got the longbowman. And it appears we are charging over here for the, the remaining man on the battlefield. Where are they? So, we lost. Nobody. Pleased with that. My allies lost four dead. Six of them are wounded. Enemies have three men remaining. There's actually one of them's behind us, so maybe worth me turning around this way. Nope, he's gone. Only one left, and he's routed from the battlefield, so very pleased with that. Very pleased. Another great battle for Sir Richard Dragonheart. And huzzah! We have done it. Victory! Also, let me know in the comment section do you prefer me to fight with first person view or third person view? I don't really mind what I do. I don't mind changing up every now and again. There we go, we had two kills. Well, one kill, one wounded. And our relations, look at that. Westlands have gone back up to 22. And Garrison Prester loves me an awful lot, so... You're my prisoner. Take this lord as a prisoner. Access the item pool. Oh my. Oh, look at this armour. This is quite good armour. So, plus 46. And away that. To mock them. 
how much space do I oh I have plenty of space right we're gonna take this for my companions we got good boots already but my companions may need them and the axe may be useful as well done got some coins as well and I'm going to actually let's see who we got Fenner, Gunnir Pike and Sir Clavis I think Gunnir Pike has got probably the worst equipment yeah he doesn't have very good equipment at all so we'll give him that oh he can't have it that's not good he can have that though which is better he got plus 17 boots already so he doesn't need any boots he has a hatchet this is a chipped one-handed hatchet which is better can he wield it he can indeed so he's looking a lot better already excellent work never mind right so I can level up I'll do that in a second we're going to get a elite Westlands man at arms excellent work and we can have a veteran two veteran man at arms which is good work as well routed enemies that's good so what do we need to increase archery would be useful so put a few in archery and let's take a couple in one handed and we'll do some two handed as well and I want to increase my charisma because that increases my uh, party capacity and then I'm thinking trainer, oh we're already on two for trainer hmm, power, if I am flesh and power strike is on four already athletics is a possibility foraging maybe engineer, engineer is going to be useful so we go with that because that means that sieges don't last as long but anyway I'm going to end the episode there I've been Dragonheart, hope you've all enjoyed, until next time, goodbye.